You know, there are plenty of them out there, but they are silent. Because they are worried about predators. And when they see us, a young technological civilization, gaining capabilities that may threaten them, they might visit us. What if the most distant spacecraft ever launched, Voyager 1, just sent back a signal so strange that even a quantum AI couldn't explain it? In the darkest reaches of interstellar space, 15 billion miles from Earth, Voyager 1 has been experiencing mysterious data anomalies that have puzzled NASA engineers. Recent analysis suggests these aren't just random glitches. When fed into advanced data processing systems, these patterns reveal something truly perplexing. Over the past year, Voyager 1's communications have deteriorated into what initially appeared to be noise. But beneath this garbled data, some researchers believe there might be coherent patterns that don't match our understanding of interstellar physics. This isn't just about a spacecraft glitching. It's about the possibility that Voyager's final whispers are carrying a message we were never meant to hear. After decades in the void between stars, Earth's farthest ambassador, may have encountered something unexpected in the cosmic darkness. As Voyager's power supply dwindles, these could be among the last transmissions we ever receive from humanity's most distant explorer. And what they contain might force us to question everything we thought we knew about interstellar space. The Strange New Clues Voyager 1's latest troubles began in 2022, when its attitude control system started sending back completely garbled telemetry. Engineers trace this to a computer fault. The spacecraft had inexplicably begun routing data through a component unused for years. Then, in late 2023, things got stranger. For almost seven months, Voyager transmitted nothing but gibberish data. NASA eventually blamed a corrupted memory chip, but not before receiving months of unintelligible signals from interstellar space. The most baffling incident came in October of 2024, after a routine command, NASA briefly lost contact altogether. When the signal returned, Voyager was transmitting on an unexpected frequency, using its backup S-band radio system that had been dormant since 1981, a system that somehow activated itself after 43 years of silence. But these recent glitches aren't isolated incidents. They're part of a pattern stretching back decades. In 1980, as Voyager approached Saturn, it detected unusual oscillations in the planet's rings that defied explanation for years. In the late 1990s, Voyager recorded inexplicable dropouts in cosmic ray readings, brief moments when these interstellar particles seemed to vanish completely. Even more compelling were the intermittent plasma wave spikes detected in 2013 to 2014, just after Voyager crossed into interstellar space. These microbursts suggested unknown shock waves or disturbances in the void between stars. Think about this for a moment. Every time Voyager's data looks a little strange, engineers assume it's just old hardware acting up. But what if, what if the patterns repeat? What if hidden inside the static is something we've overlooked for decades? Would we even recognize it? The timeline of these anomalies creates an unsettling pattern one that culminates in what some researchers are now calling the most puzzling Voyager mystery yet. A pattern so subtle, it took advanced computational methods to detect it lurking in the noise. What might Voyager be trying to tell us from the edge of known space? What the AI found. When researchers began analyzing the corrupted data streams from Voyager, they needed tools beyond conventional methods. The patterns were too faint, too complex for standard analysis. This led to speculation about what might be hidden in the noise. Some of the most intriguing claims emerged from online communities. One theory suggested that when the distorted signals were processed through advanced pattern recognition, they revealed something astonishing. Embedded imagery. Not random pixels, but what appeared to be a mirrored image of a human face amid mathematical formulas. Even more puzzling were reports that the anomalous data wasn't static, it seemed to evolve. According to these speculations, each time analysts applied a new decoding method, the signal structure would shift, almost as if responding to their attempts to understand it. If you're fascinated by this mystery, make sure to subscribe and hit like, because Voyager's story is far from over. 
Among the strangest viral claims was the idea that a data packet arrived with a timestamp predating its receipt on Earth, as if the information had somehow broken the rules of causality itself, arriving before being sent. This bizarre temporal anomaly has fueled intense debate among those following Voyager's journey. Perhaps most unsettling were suggestions that hidden within the garbled transmissions were precise coordinates, not random numbers, but actual terrestrial locations corresponding to places on Earth with unusual magnetic properties. What makes these theories captivating isn't just their strangeness, it's the implication of intelligence, the notion that something might be actively responding to our efforts, adapting its communication to our methods of listening. If these anomalies really are more than hardware glitches, then the question is obvious. Who, or what, is on the other side of Voyager's signal? Stick with us, because what comes next may be even more unsettling. Moving beyond the viral theories, let's explore what scientists actually consider plausible explanations if Voyager truly detected something unusual in interstellar space. First, Voyager could be encountering a new type of interstellar wave, ripples in the plasma between stars that we've never observed before. These might be shock fronts from ancient supernovas, spanning billions of miles but too subtle to detect from Earth. As Voyager passes through these waves, its instruments might register patterns that appear rhythmic or structured. The second possibility involves interaction with a rogue interstellar object. Voyager might be passing near a molecular cloud fragment or an ancient comet nucleus drifting between stars. These objects could create localized magnetic field distortions or plasma densities that affect Voyager's transmissions in ways we've never seen. Third, Voyager could be positioned at just the right point for gravitational lensing to occur. Imagine holding up a glass of water in front of a light bulb. The light bends, distorts, and creates patterns that weren't there before. Now replace the glass with a star and the light with cosmic radio waves. Suddenly, Voyager might be hearing echoes from places we never intended. This phenomenon could cause distant radio sources to be magnified and focused toward Voyager, creating signal patterns that appear artificial when they reach Earth. So, is this terrifying? Maybe not in the Hollywood sense. But if Voyager is picking up the fingerprints of interstellar waves or distant objects, it means we're already discovering things beyond our textbooks, things no other probe has ever seen. What makes this truly remarkable is that Voyager 1 wasn't designed for these kinds of observations. Built with 1970s technology and now running on minimal power, it's detecting phenomena its creators never imagined it would encounter. And yet, there's still the possibility we can't ignore that something out there knows Voyager is here. After all, Voyager carries the golden record, humanity's message to the cosmos. What if, against astronomical odds, someone or something found it? The Human Question What makes the Voyager anomalies so captivating isn't just their scientific implications. It's their profound connection to one of humanity's most ambitious attempts at cosmic communication. Unlike any spacecraft before it, Voyager 1 was intentionally designed to be found. Each probe carries the famous golden record, a gold-plated copper disc containing sounds and images of Earth, greetings in 55 languages, and a map showing our location in the galaxy. It was humanity's message in a bottle, cast into the cosmic ocean. If the golden record was humanity's greeting card to the galaxy, are these anomalies the first return letter? These efforts reflect our deep desire for connection beyond Earth. We've been reaching outward for decades, hoping someone might reach back. Let me put it this way. If tomorrow you checked your mailbox and found a letter addressed to you in your own handwriting, dated 50 years ago, how would you react? That's the feeling some scientists get when they see Voyager's data behaving in ways no one can quite explain. Some speculative reports have even suggested that elements in Voyager's anomalous signals bear similarities to components of our own messages, as if something studied the golden record and the Arecibo message, then responded using patterns we might recognize. What if something found Voyager 1 and is attempting communication through the only channel available by manipulating the spacecraft's own transmissions back to Earth? And the most unsettling part? Voyager doesn't have much time left, meaning this could be its final message before it falls silent forever. 
By 2025, Voyager's power supply will likely be too weak to support its science instruments. If there truly is something trying to communicate, the window is closing rapidly. The coming silence. Voyager 1 is running out of time. After journeying through space for nearly half a century, the spacecraft's power supply is rapidly diminishing. The spacecraft runs on radioisotope thermoelectric generators, nuclear power sources that convert heat from decaying plutonium into electricity. These generators lose about four watts of power every year, and Voyager systems are already operating on a minimal energy budget. NASA engineers have performed miracles keeping Voyager functioning this long. They've shut down non-essential systems one by one, carefully allocating the remaining power to maintain basic operations and communications. But the laws of physics can't be denied. By late 2025 or early 2026, Voyager will no longer have enough power to operate its scientific instruments. Shortly after, it will lose the ability to communicate with Earth altogether. This isn't just another glitch. This could be Voyager's last whisper, a final secret carried across 15 billion miles of space. The timing makes these recent anomalies all the more significant. Any patterns detected now represent possibly the last data we'll ever receive from interstellar space for decades to come. No other functioning spacecraft has crossed the heliopause, and none will reach Voyager's current position for many years. When Voyager falls silent, humanity will lose its eyes and ears in interstellar space. Our furthest outpost will become a mute messenger, still carrying the golden record, but no longer able to tell us what it encounters. So the question becomes, are we listening closely enough? Are we treating this as just static from an old spacecraft, or as the last chance to hear something truly extraordinary? Every bit of data from Voyager now takes on heightened importance. Engineers and scientists are paying attention to even the smallest anomalies, knowing that this could be our final opportunity to detect something unprecedented from beyond our solar system. The impending silence of Voyager creates an urgency that transforms how we view these mysterious data patterns. They aren't just scientific curiosities. They're potentially the last notes in a cosmic conversation that's about to end. To fully appreciate the significance of these potential anomalies, we need to understand Voyager's extraordinary journey and the remarkable legacy it represents. Launched in September 1977, Voyager 1 was part of NASA's ambitious mission to explore the outer planets. It flew by Jupiter in 1979, capturing unprecedented images of the gas giant's swirling clouds and discovering volcanic activity on its moon, Io, the first active volcanoes found beyond Earth. In November 1980, Voyager 1 encountered Saturn, photographing its intricate ring system and mysterious moon Titan. After completing this grand tour, Rather than targeting another planet, Voyager was directed to continue outward, racing toward the edge of our solar system. For decades, Voyager traveled through the heliosphere, the bubble of charged particles and magnetic fields created by our sun. Then, in August 2012, Voyager 1 crossed the heliopause, becoming the first human-made object to enter interstellar space. Today, Voyager 1 has traveled more than 15 billion miles from Earth. Its signals, moving at the speed of light, take over 21 hours to reach us. Every bit of data represents a connection to the most distant human creation in existence. But Voyager was always meant to be more than a scientific instrument. The golden record aboard each Voyager spacecraft contains 115 images of Earth, natural sounds like wind and thunder, musical selections from different cultures, and greetings in 55 languages. It includes a map showing Earth's location and instructions for playing the record. This cosmic time capsule transforms Voyager from mere machinery into a cultural ambassador. It carries human voices singing and speaking, Chuck Berry's Johnny B. Good, Bach's Brandenburg Concerto, and a recording of a mother's first words to her newborn baby. It bears the imprint of our species, our art, our languages, our planet, and our location in the cosmos. This profound symbolic dimension is why anomalies in Voyager's transmissions resonate so deeply. Each glitch, each unexplained pattern, each strange transmission isn't just scientific data. It's potentially the next chapter in humanity's longest conversation. 
Voyager's legacy isn't measured only in scientific discoveries, but in its role as our most distant emissary. It's why these final transmissions carry such emotional weight. They aren't just the last data points from a dying machine. They're the final communications from a messenger we sent to the stars. As we've explored today, quantum AI analysis may have found something in Voyager's data that challenges everything we thought we knew about interstellar space. While NASA engineers have attributed recent anomalies to aging hardware, the patterns detected over decades raise profound questions. Whether these anomalies represent undiscovered interstellar phenomena, gravitational lensing effects, or simply the complex failures of a spacecraft operating far beyond its intended lifespan, they remind us that Voyager's mission continues to surprise, unsettle, and inspire us almost five decades after launch. The beauty of Voyager's story lies in this uncertainty. Even as it approaches its final silence, this distant explorer forces us to confront the vast unknown surrounding our tiny solar system. Each unexplained data point becomes a doorway to possibility, a chance to wonder what might exist beyond our current understanding. Voyager 1 is humanity's furthest messenger. And whether the anomaly is noise or a hidden message, it forces us to ask, what else waits out there in the dark? In a universe 13.8 billion years old and unimaginably vast, Voyager 1 has traveled just 15 billion miles, barely leaving our cosmic neighborhood. Yet even this short journey has revealed how much we still have to learn. As Voyager's power fades and its voice grows fainter, its legacy of discovery and wonder only grows stronger. This small spacecraft, built with technology less powerful than a modern smartphone, continues to challenge our understanding of reality from the edge of interstellar space. If you want to join us as we keep exploring these cosmic mysteries, make sure you subscribe, because Voyager may fall silent soon. But its legacy of wonder is only just beginning. What do you think? Could something be reaching out from the darkness between stars? Or is Voyager simply showing us how much more there is to discover? Let us know in the comments below.